Welcome back friends. Hey, today we're doing one of our most requested reviews and that is the Equalizer Hitch. This is a big old chunk of American steel built right here in the USA. It's got its pros and cons. We're going to talk about that today. I hope you stick around. Okay, before we get started on the equalizer hitch, I want to tell you about our summer long hitch battle. This is one of six hitches that we've been testing this spring, summer, and fall. Uh, hopefully we'll be fit wrapping it up around the middle of September, and I'll have that video to you by October. I hope that's the case. But uh, yeah, kind of breaking the YouTube rules. It's taken a long time to put hundreds and hundreds of miles on all of these hitches. Uh, this one, obviously today, we're just talking about the equalizer. Uh, I'll bring up a couple of the other hitches maybe, but uh, mostly today is just the pros and cons of the equalizer. But if you want to see that hitch battle video where we put all of these hitches against each other, same truck, same trailer, six different hitches, make sure to hit that subscribe button and also that notification bell so you don't miss that particular video. All right, I'm quite certain you've seen enough of my face, so I'm just going to show you the hitch for most of the rest of the video. Uh, we've got about 400, a little over 400 miles on this hitch. As I've mentioned, we're putting all these hitches, we're using them real life use for hundreds and hundreds of miles and then uh, comparing all of them. Today, the equalizer, pros and cons, we'll jump right into the pros. The first pro I love about the equalizer, it's USA made with USA steel. That's a huge pro for me. Um, yeah, especially the USA steel part. A lot of times you'll get USA made, but they'll get the steel from overseas. And um, yeah, I just, I really like that they use both. It's a, that's a big deal to me. Second pro is a lifetime warranty. Huge pro there. And I, you know, I don't know how much better it gets than that. These guys have been around for a long time. They're one of the original, maybe the original, um, wheelbarrow type friction uh, hitch producers, manufacturers, and they're just real confident in their product. So they, uh, the build is, that's the third pro, is the build is very good compared to the other hitches we've been using. Um, I don't know if it's the, the number one best build. It's tied for one, number one, for sure. It's just, uh, just a quality looking hitch. I mean, good looking welds. I, I'm just, uh, I'm happy with the build. It's, it's a nice chunk of steel, and I like to have some beef back here. Um, the bars are heavy and they're long. The uh, the saddles, one of my actually my probably my very favorite single feature is when you're hooking up. They give you these pins for the saddles, so I don't have to worry about uh, like a cotter pin or whatever. I can just pop that down and flip it under. Now somebody somebody have mentioned that these have worked their way loose before. I didn't experience that. Uh, while 400 miles is a decent test obviously I haven't lived with it for years so uh, I have heard that they can work themselves loose but I didn't experience that at all and I love this design you can see how thick the saddles are uh, they're thicker than some of the others we've used uh, very simple design easy to set up uh, you can obviously adjust your setup here with these uh, those nuts and bolts so pretty simple to adjust as well uh, a little finicky setting it up. I'll talk about that in just a second in the cons. But overall, the build is really good. All right, cool. next up is performance. Just getting you some slow close-up stuff. Uh, performance is very, very good. Uh, it's not number one on the list of the six hitches we've used, but it's towards the top for sure. Uh, I'm not going to reveal too much on that. I've already got those figured out, but um, I definitely want you to watch that video. But it performs very well and uh, it performs as good as there's a big following for these i mean everyone's telling me use the equalizer use the equalizer when's the equalizer coming out when are you doing that video and um yeah for good reason it does perform well it's again uh, towards the top of the list and uh i think a lot of that has to do with the build and the fact that you just know what they're doing they've been around for a while all right one last pro uh it is uh, you can't back up with this. So you can back up with all of the hitches I've been using. I think uh, the old school where you have a, a separate bar attached over here, 
Um, obviously you can't back up with those, but with these you can absolutely back up. All right, let's move on to cons. The first big con for me is I can't open my tailgate when I use this hitch. And it has a shorter uh, shank up there, as you can see. And yeah, I can't open, I can't use my tailgate. I can get it about uh, maybe halfway down before it hits my tongue jack. But for me, that is a big con. I know some of you will say, well, the closer it is to your bumper, the less it'll sway. Eh, that's not necessarily true. We've had other hitches that I could use the tailgate and they performed as well or better. So, um, so yeah, I can't use my tailgate when the using the equalizer hitch. Second big con about the equalizer is it is loud. So again, we've used six hitches now. Uh, it, this is by far the loudest of any of them. Uh, I was actually, it actually surprised me how loud it was. Uh, and yeah, I'm aware you can shoot some grease here. You can put some plastic inserts on the saddles. Um, I, I know all of those tricks, uh, but I didn't have to do that with the other hitches. So, um, so yeah, it, it is absolutely loud and I know that's gonna bug some people. Finally, let's talk about price. And I didn't put this in the pro or the con category because it's kind of middle of the road. Uh, you're gonna, depending on the weight of your hitch and the bars you need, uh, you're looking at anywhere from 650 to close to $800. So it's kind of, uh, it's not the, the least expensive of the hitches we've used, but um, it's also not the most expensive. So it's by far not the most expensive. Okay, friends, a big thanks to Equalizer for sending this out. They sent this out to us to take part in our hitch battle that I mentioned before. I really appreciate that. You gotta love that this is USA made with USA steel. And also that lifetime warranty is tough to beat. So, uh, so yeah, big props to, to Equalizer for sending this out. They also, anytime I work with a company, I ask them, hey, can you hook our viewers up with anything? And yes, they were happy. They're gonna give you guys 15% off one of these hitches. Uh, I'll put the website below. I'll put the promo code WONDER15 down in the in the description box below as well. So save yourself uh, well over $100 just for watching this video. And thanks to Equalizer for that. I make nothing on that, by the way. Um, but thanks to them for offering you guys that awesome discount. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope this was useful. If it was, please share. And as always, consider subscribing. See ya.